Well, it was another day at the Martinsville Speedway, and fans from as far as Canada were enjoying the races this weekend. WSLS 10's Duke Carter spent a second day at the track and met up with volunteers who are giving fans the ultimate experience. Drivers aren't putting the pedal to the metal and are heading down to the Martinsville Speedway. But some drivers are making a grand entrance. This Speedway fan, Billy Bennett, check this out. He decked out his Cadillac. You got a camouflage Cadillac, you got to have bullhorns. I mean, if you ain't got the bullhorns, you just ain't got the Cadillac. Over at the Martinsville Speedway, fans, young and old, watch the truck races. Like many, some fans came as children and are now bringing their kids to the races. I enjoyed it, man, especially the truck race in Martinsville itself, as has always been one of my top races. But one group is helping with the fan experience. We're here to serve the fans. Elliot Yancey is the executive director of Raceway Ministries. Every NASCAR track across the country, uh, there's a local group of volunteers that comes out and works with guest services. Yancey says about 75 people in the Martinsville region are volunteering their time to offer rides in the golf cart to giving out free food or water. Well, we're very enthusiastic about it, and, and we are grateful for the opportunity that we're given through the, the local speedways and those relationships. Yancey says the organization has been in existence for 30 years, serving the community. It's not something we take lightly. Um, so we try to do it to the best of our ability and be as professional as we can. To give fans the ultimate experience at the Speedway. If you want to see some good racing, this is the place to be. I always uh, lift up Martinsville. This is my hometown. Uh, one of the reasons I love living here. Stay with WSLS Channel 10 for all the latest on what's happening here at the Martinsville Speedway. In Ridgeway, Duke Carter, WSLS 10.